Hello everyone, this is Jude from EasyTex. In this video, I will be showing you how to still upgrade from any version of Windows 7 to Windows 10 for free. Now the first thing is to verify that whatever version of Windows 7 you are using, that is activated and genuine. And to verify that, you go to your computer folder, click on System Properties, and scroll down to Windows Activation. Here you should ensure it says Windows is activated and that you can see the Microsoft Genuine Software logo on the right hand side. Please note that if you activated your Windows 7 offline, that is without being connected to the internet, and you go ahead to install Windows 10 offline as well, your Windows 7 activation key won't be valid for Windows 10. Hence, after upgrading, your Windows 10 will not inherit the activation from your Windows 7. So please ensure you connect to the internet during or after activating your Windows 7 in order for the activation to remain valid for your Windows 10. So now that we have verified that our Windows 7 is activated and genuine, let's go ahead and upgrade to Windows 10. Now there are two possible ways we can perform this upgrade. One way is to upgrade online, that is while connected to the internet. Another way is to upgrade offline using a USB stick. In this video, I'll be demonstrating only the online upgrade. I'll be making a separate video for the offline upgrade procedure. So open your browser and search download Windows 10. Now click on the download Windows 10 disk. That's the second link and there it will take you to Microsoft Windows 10 download page. Then you click on download tool now. Wait a bit for the download to be completed. Then launch the media creation tool. accept the license terms now it says getting a few things ready um, we would have to wait a bit okay so ensure that it's on the option upgrade this PC now then click next now it's downloading Windows 10 this is going to take a while so I'm going to fast forward it and then after the downloading of Windows 10 installation then we'll get back and continue with the procedure
to keep after you upgrade to Windows. So by default, you install Windows 10 Pro and keep your personal files and applications. If you want to change what you want to keep, if you want to delete some files or if you want to make fresh installation, then you could go to this option and then you could select what to keep, whether to keep only personal files or to keep nothing. So for now, we're going to keep personal files and applications and then we we'll click next. security reasons you might decide to turn off these settings then click accept And that completes our upgrade. So we have successfully upgraded from Windows 7 to Windows 10. Now to verify the activation status of our new Windows 10, you go to your file explorer, this PC, and then you click on system properties. Then click on change product key or upgrade your edition of Windows. And then here you can see your activation status. It says that we have Windows 10 Pro 
and it says that Windows is activated with digital license. So we have a fully activated Windows 10. This chart here shows the corresponding edition of Windows 10 that you get after the upgrade, depending on what edition of Windows 7 you were previously running. So you can already see what edition of Windows 10 you get after your upgrade. And that completes the upgrade. If you found this video useful, please subscribe to my channel and share with other friends who might also find it useful. And if you have any questions regarding the procedures in the video, please post in the comment section below and I will try to get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks for watching and see you again soon.